What's kicking y'all? Quick Panic here, and I'm back with episode number 12 of our Pokemon Soul Silver Randomized Nuzlocke. And last time we kicked Whitney's butt, we got a cool squirt bottle, and we were heading up here to get our pseudo Wudo encounter. So, did we ever? We didn't. Did we ever go back and get uh, more Pokeballs? I, I know we got Ultra Balls. Is that enough? Uh, didn't I? I got some Baller Cash though. I got. I got. Fat, fat dollars. Oh, let's get some more Pokeballs. I don't want to, like, randomize, like, a Celebi or something, and then I run out of Pokeballs or something. Um, which is faster? I think I don't touch any... Hey, look! Blue Apricorn! Um, I think I don't touch any grass if I go this way. And I think there's a TM for Dig that I can get over here. But you guys have seen my randomized TMs. It's probably going to be randomized to something like... Sweet Kiss again? Didn't we get Sweet Kiss like 19 times? Uh, I think that's the TM. I think it is. What's up, man? Playing your Game Boy in Pokemon? What is there even to play if Pokemon is real? Uh, let's see... Hondewberry. Okay. I thought this was t the uh, TM for Dig. Maybe it's... There's like another... On the left-hand side? There's another item or two? Maybe two? Isn't there like an invisible one? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. A little bit tired. I played uh, at Oktoberfest uh, today, and we just got home. Silverwind! Hey, that's actually a good move! That's a bug move! Um, I can't remember what the base power is. I think it might be 60. Maybe it's not as good as I remember. Uh, 60. Might you? Oh, that's what it was. It might use the Razor stats. It's like... Um, Ominous Wind and Ancient Power both do that kind of thing. Is this where the invisible item is? Yes. Oh, Silk Scarf. Raises normal moves power. We're not going to use that. Okay, so let's go ahead and hop down to Goldenrod City. And we are going to buy some more Pokeballs. Ultra Balls. Yeah, we're gonna get some more Ultra Balls. Just in case, I don't wanna have like a Moltres instance again where I ran out. I didn't have any choice then, but now we're balling out our minds and we can afford, we can afford the finest of Pokeballs. Does this girl give me a Quick Claw? Hey, thanks for the Quick Claw. Is it actually a Quick Claw? Let's see. Oh yeah. Okay, for some reason that wasn't randomized, but Quick Claw's cool. Anything in Trash Can? Nope. Uh, dude, the Gen 1 Pokemon games taught me that I need to check every single Trash Can, because when you go on the SSN and you check out, I think it's like the dining room or the kitchen, like, there's a Great Ball in, in one of the Trash Cans, and at the beginning of the game, that is a, that is a good, that's a good item. Usually take that Great Ball and I go into a Diglett Cave, or Diglett Tunnel, and I go for the, I think it's like 1% encounter rate, uh, Doug Trio. Let's see, let's go ahead and heal up. And I use that uh, that Great Ball that I get on the SSN, like that's my ritual, is I use that Great Ball to try and catch a Doug Trio in the Diglett Tunnel. Um, and then you can use it against Lieutenant Surge. It is super clutch, super clutch, because before that, you could potentially have a Nitto King, but it doesn't get any ground stab if you're playing Gen 1. Uh, we're going to the Pokeball store, man. Uh, I think it's the second floor? What you got? Oh, yeah. Um, so we could, get, we could only get 10 Ultra Balls? That's a little bit crazy. Let's do it, though. Spend my entire fortune. Um... Is there anything I can get rid of? Something I don't need? I'm not selling that armor fossil. We're going to revive that at some point. Um, no, we're keeping all that. I'm not selling Pokeballs. Lovely kiss. We can sell the heck out of that. 1,500? Yes, please. Um, we'll sell trip. Yeah, we'll sell triple kit. We have Rock Smash. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah. Well, let's go ahead and buy a couple more... Let's get some Great Balls. Six Great Balls. That'll do. 
That'll do, pig. That'll do. No? Don't understand my movie reference? That was, uh, Babe. It was like a 90s movie about a pig. That wasn't Charlotte's Web. I healed up, right? Yes, I healed up. Okay, so let's go squirt some water on a tree. And, uh, I hope it's randomized. I'm pretty sure it'll be randomized. But, uh... What if it's not? If it's not, then we'll use it, like, as a... We'll get another encounter at whatever last area we're in. So Route 35. Or the National Park. Doesn't matter. I'll figure it out. Hopefully it's randomized. And that would be super, super cool. Hope it's randomized into... Like, I said Celebi earlier. Kind of want a Celebi. Celebi's super cool. Plus we need a Grass-type Pokemon. It would have Psychic. The only thing is it's weak to literally, like, half of the types that exist. So that's, that's kind of a bummer. Bummer. Keep Sparkums out front. My little paralyzing rat is going to help us catch this. Looks pretty, pretty pseudo-woodo to me. I'm the flower shop's Floria. Listen, 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 Linda, listen. When I sprinkled water on that wiggly tree, it jumped right up. It just has to be a Pokemon. If you soaked it, oh, that's a squirt bottle. Soak the tree for me. I want to see what happens. All right, wiggle, wiggle. Yes. <laughs> Look at him. This is how you use a squirt bottle. Get. Yes. Yes. All right, all right. The odd tree attacked. Let's see what this tree is, man. What are we mistaking for a tree? <gasps> oh my God. This got so serious so fast. Oh. Yo, my pulse is racing. All right, Sparkums, let's do this. I have goosebumps. Oh my gosh. A, this looks nothing like a tree. B, if you squirt Sweet Coon with water, he's just gonna laugh. Like he's water type. Okay, I'm sorry, Kraken. Kraken is totally gone if we catch this. Wow, Sparkums, that did nothing. That did absolutely nothing. Uh, let's go for another one. Ooh, Bubble Beam in the rain from a Suicune? Oh my god! What the heck? My heart can't take this today. Uh, I don't think you have Aurora Beam yet, uh, but I don't want to kill Drogon. Okay, Kraken, help me catch your replacement. One HP. What? Oh, poor Sparkums is constantly almost dying. He needs a freaking Thunderstone. Uh, let's see. I think Aurora Beam will lower accuracy. That did nothing. Oh, you have Bite. Great. So you can still hit me with something. That did 11 damage. That's actually... Let's see how much Side Beam does. Oh my gosh. Sparkums... We're, how deep are we? We're 8 minutes deep. Sparkums almost died. Our Sudowoodo is actually a freaking Suicune. Can we stop? Dude, this Suicune is a monster. Okay, I don't think we I don't think we can afford a crit on Aurora Beam or on a on Psy Beam. So let's go Aurora Beam. Hopefully we get an accuracy drop. Oh What the heck? Please. Hold on, I'm, I'm not taking any chances. We need to. We need to super potion up. Spark comes with one HP. Oh, this got so serious so fast. My randomizer was literally randomized by, like, the devil. Like, have you seen our encounters? This is insane. I'm pretty sure Suicune's catch rate is, like... Calm down, Kraken! Uh, Suicune. What number are you? You're, like, 240-something. 245. Catch rate. Three. 
Okay, it doesn't get any weaker than this, so... You're kind of fast, aren't you? Would a fastball work on you? 85. Uh, let's try a fastball. It'd be cool if we caught Sweet Queen in a fastball. I wouldn't be mad. Or, you know, zero shakes. That's fine, too. I just realized that fastball looks like, um, if you've watched the original Pokemon, like the first episode, uh, Pikachu actually has a Pokeball. And it never goes back in it, but it has like a Thunderbolt on it. <clears throat> Two shakes. Um, that's what the, the, the fastball looks like. Was Pikachu in a fastball? Maybe. I'm gonna use Great Balls first. I only have 15 Ultra Balls. Oh, please, Suicune. Please, Suicune. Oh. You need to join the team. You need to join. Dude, our team would be stacked! Oh my gosh. Please. Beautiful, beautiful Suicune with your beautiful purple locks of awesome hair. Oh, my heart. I thought we were going to go grab our encounter. It was going to be something middle of the road, which it's not. And go see if we could face Morty. Oh my gosh. Suicune. I love Suicune. Suicune's design is freaking gorgeous. You're, are you fat? 412 pounds? Heavy ball. Heavy ball, man. Look, it's beautiful. It's got blue dots on it just for you. It matches. Can you at least shake to show a little bit of appreciation? Like, oh, I forgot it's been le using Leer this whole time. My defense is absolute buns right now. Shake. Oh my gosh. Is 412 pounds not heavy? I feel like that's heavy. I know there's like an algorithm for it and I, I used to have parts of it memorized. Oh, two shakes. So you're a little bit chubby. Bubble Beam in the rain on Kraken. I need to heal. I'm not taking any chances. Not taking any chances. Sparkums. Every time I go back to heal, Sparkums with his 1 HP. He's like, hey, quick panic. I hope I did a good job because I'm almost dead. Poor guy. Okay. Let's try some Ultra Balls. We got 15 of them. 15. Dude, I'm pulling out the big bucks for you, Suicune. And all you do is shoot bubbles at my face. That is rude. That's literally like spitting in my face. It's practically spitting in my face. Look how pretty that Ultra Ball... Dude, just stay in the Ultra Ball. You have to be exhausted, man. Look, you barely have any health. You're paralyzed. I can fix that up, bro. If you, if you join, if you join Team Quick Panic, we'll go to the Pokemon Center and get you fixed up. You can be in all the trainer battles. You can literally crack skulls better than Kraken can. And his name is Kraken. He has crack. No! Well, rest in peace, Kraken. Wow. That's our first death, guys. <sighs> Suicune doesn't have Aurora Beam yet, so we can go into Drogon. Suicune, you owe it to me to fill this spot on my team. Oh, Kraken. I'm so sad. Like, my heart, why? I can't take this. This this is a roller coaster of emotions. And there are no brakes. You cannot get off this ride. Sweet Coon. Please. You need to stay in the Ultra Ball. You need to stay in it. Yes! Oh! Yes! Okay, so I'm sad about Kraken. I really am, guys. Like, I loved I loved Kraken. But Sweet Coon was kinda like, hey, I realize I'm taking this guy's place. Six foot seven. This Pokemon races across the land. It is said that the north winds will somehow blow whenever it appears. Oh my gosh. 
nickname for Suicune. I don't think anybody hit up the comment section in the last episode yet. Let's see. Um, there we go. Oh! Episode 1. Episode 11. So, Voltage X80. Commented, but he didn't say anything. He didn't have a he didn't have a uh, a nickname in mind. So, we're we're going to have to make our own. Um Dude, he totally This is the usurper, man. He took he took to Kraken's throne. He usurped the hell out of Kraken. Usurp. Per. That's how you spell that, right? Pretty sure. I don't use that word very often. Usurper. Yep. I wish we could say usurper of water, but that won't fit. Okay. We have to go bury Kraken. That was fun! It really was not. None of that was fun. I mean, I'm super excited, but, like, I'm also very sad, so I can't... I want to give you this for entertaining me! She literally gets off on the deaths of Pokemon. She is laughing. She is dancing on Kraken's grave. I'm not reading her anymore. I don't care about your par- No, no, I don't care about your berry pots. I don't care how many gifts you give me. You literally- You're dancing on Kraken's grave. And I'm not a fan of that. I'm- Don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. Oh. I mean, this is what Nuzlocks are about, man. The stress of the of the game is uh, what makes it fun. So how many episodes? This is episode 12. We made it 12 episodes. We got 11 clean episodes before our death. Oh, man. So now I have to make a death box. Kraken, man. I'm a Pokemon. Can I rename this? Um, box 18. It doesn't do it justice. Uh, will this fit? Mm, okay. Um, I like I play Yu-Gi-Oh, right? So I wanted to say graveyard, but we'll just put grave. Somebody put like some people put death or dead. We're going Yu-Gi-Oh with this grave. Is there wallpaper that like represents that? Desert, savanna, crag. What does crag look like? No, that doesn't look. That's not dark enough, man. Dude, no. He's okay. If there's nothing better, is this just black? Oh. Oh, I guess I unlock other wallpapers later. That's right. He went to heaven, dude. Kraken went to heaven. He's he's up in the sky watching us, man. He's gonna. Okay, that that's it. He, he's gonna be watching over us. From the, the big grave in the sky. Alright, Kraken. Hand over your wise glasses. Oh, this hurts me, man. In the grave. And Usurper is freaking quirky. He's on the team, though. Uh, yeah, he's on the team. War Turtle made me think twice. What? What has uh, metal powder on it? I need to get that in a second. Hold on, these guys have items? Rantan has a dread plate, which is for Arceus, if you're not familiar. Metal power, powder. Okay. Okay. Let's move some items. Let's snag that dread plate. Boost dark type moves. I think bite's the only dark type move on our team. This one boosts. Oh, that one's for Ditto. I was thinking silver powder instead of metal powder. Let's heal up. Oh man. What a roller coaster, man. Like I was on top of the world and then Kraken got smushed. Okay, guys. We're moving. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't want to heal twice. 
We're moving up to Ecruteek City to go check out Morty. Oh man. Can you Serper learn, learn anything cool? I still have just Megahorn and Silverwind. Uh, I don't think I want anything. Oh, but I have items. What, what other items do we have? Could just do the Wise Glasses, right? Rest in peace, uh, Kraken. Nothing really better. So let's go ahead and hand these over. Guys, I'm so sad. I'm sorry. I'm normally like more upbeat. Oh, but hold on. Look at Suicune though. I know I've seen Suicune before because in Hard Gold, Soul Silver, they uh, they have like a post. It's not post Elite Four, is it? No, I think you get you get Suicune. Um, there's like a Suicune mini quest that we're gonna play through later. Little do they know, we already have our own Suicune. That looks amazing following me, just for the record. Hey, this is my dog, Suicune, Usurper of Thrones, Cracker of Krakens. That crit, dude. Another fossil? Yeah, I think that one's for Lily. We got Lily and uh, Anerith. We actually get another encounter. Um, so this is Route 37. Sparklings is going to go up front. Um, Route 37 encounter is... Oh, it's a Piplup! Okay, I like this. It's not a water Pokemon, but whatever. Ah, oh, hi! Hi, guys! Sparkums here! Remember, I almost died! Poor Sparkums, man. He... If I lost Sparkums and Kraken in the same battle... Dude, I, I probably would have just turned off. Like, I would just l literally just stopped recording right there. No outro. Um, Piplup can take a quick attack, can he? Definitely. Definitely. Oh, yeah. Water sport, joke's on you. Now you're all wet, and now my Pikachu can knock out your Onix. Because that's how it works in Pokemon. Alright, let's get one more quick attack in there. Sparkums, why? Dude, Sparkums with the criticals, am I right? Like, seriously, if you've been watching this series, Sparkums is super critical. Of new, I, I guess he just knew he was not going to cut the team. Like, he was not going to make the cut. And we had, we already got Usurper over here. Proven his worth. He literally killed Kraken to join the team. I was like, you know, I'll retire Kraken. He's like, no, no, no. I'll take care of Kraken. And literally squished him in front of me and then hopped in the Ultra Ball. That's what happened. Hold on, I'm psychic real quick. Pokemon can't do a thing if they are asleep. I'll show you how scary that is. A little bit terrifying. Might want to work on your people skills. Greg? His name is literally Greg. Anyway, we have big Sparkums here again. Sparkums, why don't you want to do this? Eat eat some pancakes, man. Uh, let's send Beetleborg out. Beetleborg's our strongest guy, and I'm, I'm not even sad about it. Thunderbolt me? You think, you, you think you're cool? You think a Thunderbolt scares me? Sparkums? Sparkums doesn't have anything on you, but Beetleborg. He's literally going to break a brick on you. They call him the Breaker of Bricks. He's literally... Breaker the Magical Warrior trained with Beetleborg because he was so good at breaking bricks. And Breaker just needed some help. Honestly. Later, Greg. I lost. That's pretty sad. He's a sociopath, man. He's literally a sociopath. I, I literally didn't want to talk to him again. But I know there are some Apricorns up here. We could have had an Ampharos! I'm sorry, Sparkums would have been off the team. Sparkums would have been straight up off the team. What's up with all these electric Pokemon, though? Our encounters are all water Pokemon. Look at these. Oh, and it's the... What is today's Sunday? Breaking the fourth wall? Uh... Little Sunday Man is here to give me a held item. Can't remember which one he gives. I know the beak is over below Cherry Grove. No, not Cherry Grove. What's the first town? You know the one. Um, soft Sand is on the beach. What is this guy gonna give me? Hi, I'm Sunny of Sunday, meaning it's Sunday today. 
I was told to give you this if I saw you! Obtain the magnet! That thing? Um, what was it now? Oh, I remember now! Ho ho, Minnie! All of a sudden it's Mickey Mouse! A Pokemon that knows electric type moves should hold it! Ho ho! My sis Monica said it powers up electric type moves! Monica is of Monday, I think. I think, I think, I think. Sparkums, you got a magnet now, bro. So these aren't being randomized. I think I only randomize field items, I guess. Um, luck incense can definitely go to somebody, though. What is Beetleborg holding? Lucky Egg? You don't need a Lucky Egg anymore. You know who needs a Lucky Egg? AJ. Apparently AJ is sticking around because we can only find water Pokemon. Alright, so let's get up to Ecruteak. And I think... Do we want to have a double battle? Oh. Leftovers are going over to Usurper of Thrones. And... We have a potion, right? Let's let's squirt one of our... Who, who's injured? Beetleborg. There you go. Okay. Double battle. Let's literally... We're going to... Okay, we'll put AJ out there. AJ and Usurper. Usurper needs some, some, some air time. Creepy twins again. Hey, mister. Let's play. All right. I'm bringing out a Pokemon. I think they normally have, like, a Clefairy and a Jigglypuff. Lantern and a Rattata. Rattata! I don't think Usurper... Actually, both of my Pokemon are scared of Lantern, I'm pretty sure. But... I don't, I don't think Usurper cares enough. Okay, I'm not gonna, like, risk AJ for no reason. So let's put out... What's a good bet? Drogon! Lantern might have Thundershock, and that's about it, but Usurper has a butt. Like, a straight-up butt. And he eats fish for dinner. Water Gun, that's the best you had? He was targeting down AJ. And Drogon and AJ have their... They have a thing, man. They, they're like good buddies. So Drogon is going to take out Lantern to a nice stick dinner and never call him back. That's the kind of dude he is, man. Like... He will destroy you, not physically, but mentally. He's going to make you second-guess everything. Like, did I come on too strong on that first date? I don't know. And he's super critical. Did you see that? He literally touched Rantan with his head and just squirt, just, just destroyed. Literally got splattered. AJ's up to 15. Wants to learn Swift. Marry me, Juliet. You'll never have to be alone. Yeah, we're getting some T-Swift up in here. Hyper Fang. Look at the animation. <laughs> Did nothing. <laughs> literally laughable. That wasn't even like laughing for affect. I was like, that was literally hilarious how, how little damage that did. For the animation, just not impressive, man. Look how fast Usurper is. He's outspeeding a base 100 speed Drogon. I know Drogon's sassy and he like lost 10%, but still. I lost. Creepy Creepers. Another double battle. Let's just do the same thing. Like, oh my god. You are a cute little trainer. Why don't you battle me? Oh my god, Becky. Look at his butt. It's like so big. Hey, hey there. You young trainer. Won't you battle with me? I literally just came to this town. And I'm literally getting attacked by beautiful women. A Ledian and what? Radicate. Dude, Ledian looks so cool. I wish I wish Ledian had stats to back up his awesome look. But he's actually butterscotch. He's not good. He's straight up poop. Poor guy. And one of his abilities is Iron Fist. And he gets like Comet Punch? Is like the only way he can Yeah, yeah. I literally just said that, didn't I? Usurper literally thinks he's a fly. Ledian thinks he's a big, like, awesome Beetleborg guy, but he's definitely not. He's literally caught in the locks of Usurper, and he's like, Are you literally touching me? Like, is it? Why are you touching me? Do I know you? He doesn't. He doesn't know him. He's not cooler enough. Cooler enough. Cool enough. He doesn't have the clout. 
Get Bubble Beam, bro. Oh, you're still alive. AJ has a donk. Okay, but he flinched. Look how little that... I think he's actually getting healed by Comet Punch. Like, if you look real closely... Right there. Look. Ended up with more HP. Definitely got healed. Okay, so let's go ahead and bite the Letty in. And Rock Smash Raticate him. I think we got the defense drop on Raticate. So this should do a little bit more. Don't bite AJ. AJ with the critical hit. He, he was tired of that, man. He is not having it. Look at that defense. We literally... Okay. That's pretty cool. I love Aerodactyl. All right. AJ, we have to... We have to pop you in the back real quick. And we're going to throw in... Uh, Big Bad Beetleborg. Square up with him, man. Square up. I know you have butt defense. I used you in VGC. You don't survive anything. I literally have to use him with a Focus Sash. Most of the time, he sets up Tailwind and dies. That is his job. Beetleborg, level 22. Look at that attack stat, man. I've never seen the animation for that. And... Go ahead, bite this guy, and we're going to break a brick on his head. We're literally going to crack his claw, and Beetleborg is going to eat the protein inside that claw for sustenance, so he can go smash more Kinglers in the future. That's how metal he is. Look at that crit! He is so serious. AJ's up to level 17. He really wants to stay on the squad, man. He heard about my plans, and he's... You're good. Wow, you're strong. Dude, Quick Panic is getting some tonight. Like, after I stop recording, uh, he's definitely... He has plans. And we finally land an Ecrotique. Ooh, Bill's here. Hi, I'm Bill. And who are you? Hmm, quick, huh? You know what? I'm the one who developed the system to transfer Pokemon. But it couldn't have been done by me alone. For example, do you know the Hoenn region? This girl, Lynette, from Hoenn made the Pokemon storage system easier to use. My friends all over the world are making working together to improve the Pokemon trade and storage systems. I have to hurry on back to Goldenrod and see my folks. Bye bye What a suave dude. Straight up suave. He learned how to make Pokemon turn into energy and transfer them into a box. Sounds a little inhumane, but you know, whatever. Children's game. Okay, so we can actually go get our Eevee and we'll call it a day after that. But we need room in our party and AJ has, uh, he's not getting deposited. Who's, who's gonna take a break? Um, Drogon, just just stay for a second. Don't freak out. It's fine. Play nicely with the other Pokemon. Don't eat anybody. You and Viserion can play for a little bit. Like, brothers separated way too soon. If we get another dragon, you bet it's going to be Rhaegal. Alright, Suicune. I'm playing favorites right now. This is also a reminder of the risks that are being taken by playing this LP. That should be cracking. But this is ruthless. This is a ruthless game. With ruthless Pokemon. I can't even stay serious about it. Usurper of Thrones. This is literally Game of Thrones. We got we got people killing people so they can take their place. He wants to be ruler of the water Pokemon on my team. Hey, Murkrow! Murkrow! I like Murkrow. He's pretty cool. Usurper literally glows blue when he, she, it comes out. Okay, back to Route 36. We're going to go to Goldenrod and go check out Bill, Mr. Suave Bill, and see what his Eevee is going to be randomized into. Um, we're going to go this way. So, it's not the end of the episode yet because we have to go get that Eevee, but I really would like to get some comments from you guys in the comment section on these videos. That way, when I have new encounters, you guys can name the Pokemon. I think it's pretty cool. Um, 
when my viewers get to like get in on the action and you become part of it like if i named one of my pokemon no maybe that's what i'll do like you, it doesn't even have to be like hey this is what i want the nickname to be but even if you just like comment down there maybe i'll just i'll just name it after you next time i get an encounter um then you like become more attached and it makes me super sad when one of my viewers is named after a pokemon if that pokemon dies that's like heart-wrenching oh so yeah um leave a comment down below after this after you finish peeping this video um dude what a roller coaster ride we we went through some things today man we went through some things uh is this this isn't bill's house this is bill's house right yeah bill oh hi quick would you do something for me and take this eevee it came over when I was adjusting Nintendo Wi-Fi connection. I just broke the fourth wall because my voice is suave as heck. Someone has to take care of it, but I don't like being outside. Look how cool he is. Can I count on you to play with it quick? I knew you'd come through. You're the real deal. Way to go. Okay, I'm counting on you. Take good care of it. Quick received Eevee. Maybe. I don't know. We'll find out. What's the nickname? It's a Shellos! Oh, man. Okay, so I'm, I'm going to do what I just said. And it doesn't really make any sense. But your name is now Voltage. He's a ground type and a water type. I wanted a ground type, but I'm there's no way I am getting rid of Usurper. So this will just be like a hidden little gem in the PC should tragedy ever strike. All right, Voltage... That's your name. Thanks for commenting, Voltage. I appreciate it. Professor Realm said Eevee can evolve into seven different kinds. That's actually eight, bro. Get with the times. Of Pokemon. All right. So we got our Shellos. Uh, not Shellos. Gastrodon. I'm so sorry. I said Shellos. It's Gastrodon. It's only level five. It's a lax nature. Mud slab. Oh, there's a water pulse. Okay, cool. Look, he's happy. He's happy to be here. But, um... I'm going to swap him out for Drogon before the next episode. And then the next episode, we're going to go check out Burnt Tower. We're going to see Booty again. And um, I think we have a battle. We have a booty battle. So we have a booty battle coming up. And uh, maybe we'll go take on Morty. i got to practice my Morty voice for next time. But that's all i got for today. Leave a comment so I can go ahead and name one of my Pokemon after you. And leave a like if you like this video. I really appreciate all the support. It's really cool talking with you guys after you watch the videos and like sharing all the excitement, especially after episodes like this. And uh, I'm having a lot of fun doing this. So hope you guys enjoyed it. That's all I got for today. Hope you guys have an awesome day. Later.